Start this a little different. This is our garage. We live across from fairgrounds. A lot of times we wait to make noise with our cars because, well, our neighbors can be noisy, the fairgrounds, but it doesn't bother us. It's actually a plus. Enjoy. Mike rebuilt the quad jet for the El Camino. We're gonna take it for a spin. The amount of time Eric can tell you. I spent a decent amount of time just sitting there with a rag and trying to get in there and clean it. Well, let's see if it'll start up. It'll work on the warm idle. On the what? The, the warm idle. It's always been kind of high, but now there's not vacuum leaks and gaskets blowing out, it's higher. It's running good, huh? And that, that's from no throttle. Just leaning in. Nothing. Mike and I look at the 1953 Pontiac Chieftain that we just found, and then we look at a collection, a gentleman named Myron. I, I like these. They were like the longest, is it? Two, electric 225, there it is. That's a cool car. You see, it's a hard top, Mike. How is this, uh, is it Cheap. mostly uh, surface rust, or is it, a no. rot it did kind of have a unique bumper. rear, huh? Yeah, by the bumper there's a little rod and there's definitely some putty in it. The trim has married itself to each other, is it separate? Yeah, I think. Will it open? That's the thing. Yeah, the, the trim yeah. somehow got slid back and it's kind of there. Just make sure we don't pinch it in the door. I think it's going to pinch in the door. See what I'm saying? You catching me? All right. I think you got it. Oh, I don't think that's opening. That is not. It's automatic. Oh, yeah, that does not want to open. Oh, uh, look here. Did you see? What, the roof got a hole? The roof is. Oh, that's a front clip for 225 right here. Denied. That happens to you sometimes. They're like, nope. Oh, oh I just walked after bees. Look at this cheap. It, it's a cheap and it's not cool. Can you go pick up on the side? Where, where at? This side? That side? Yeah. Oh, it's coming. There we go. Nice and easy. Let's see what it is. What happened? It's a straight eight. Town. You think we're a straight eight, eight 
five nine Cummins would would get right in there. I bet well, it is kind of flat eddish. Huh. Look at the horns. Probably a good reason that they moved them out towards the front. I mean, it's pretty solid in here. Yeah, it's it's even the hood ain't that bad. I know it's more solid than it it probably seems to be. I think it's just been sitting a little bit. Look at how big of a. Six. Yeah, it has a giant rectangular battery. Starter is on this side. That's unique. Hmm. Custom air cleaner and such. I'm still astounded by the horn placement. Like. The people inside the car probably got got it pretty good. I'm worried about the dipstick. Ah, uh -huh. okay. Look at that. That's amazing. I'm gonna say nothing. Looks like nothing. She nod. I mean, could evaporate. I'm gonna try to put this down carefully. Oh, that's cool. Right there, that's one inch. Well, it's well, going down better. Hold on, don't do that. You gonna push on that? I think it's gonna need pushed back. Yeah, yeah, you gotta go over there. Go over there. Right down, it's all right. It seems good to me. He's getting in. Here you can see the trim, the colors. Got a, little, got a little cancer. Oh no. It's really? Oh uh, no. Bees? Ants. Really? Everywhere. Look at them. Yeah. They're like, you're messing with our house. We've been in here for years. Yeah. Milwaukee's best. That can's older than you. Yeah, that side's got a good hole too. Oh, yes, it does. Someone may have had the back seat. Uh, I wonder if you see right here the uh, the drip rail and the roof. I wonder if that happened here or on the, where we got it from. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Oh, that's what you were talking about with the way I mean, yeah. you brought it. Huh. It does have the looks of all the trim. And it doesn't look smashed. I'm just saying, in aspect of... Rat rod. It would never be a cute... You know what would be neat? If you slid this over a stock car chassis. Yeah. Interesting. Well, well, I don't know what you call it. Oh, look, there's a nose piece here, probably. Yes, it is. Oh, that's the right ear fiber that you would need. Is this? That's smoking the band. What's this? It's off one of them. Oh, yeah, it is. It's $2,000, and he has a title. Probably $50. I'll probably call me two. I could be wrong. Next, we take a look at a collection. A gentleman named Myron. It's just a Jeez. Power glide. That's so cool. Boy, they don't close like that anymore, huh? It... Okay. And this is a 39? This is a 39, yeah. Boy, they're just little, huh? I just started taking the paint off of it. Some of it comes off easy. It was hand painted. Okay. That, that rib is neat.
Now, would it have had a canvas, like a row up top? Yeah. That is neat. Look at that. What are the motors in these? Are they four cylinder? Yeah, they are. Four cylinder, about 13 horsepower. That's it. That's about it. I mean, you don't need much. It's not big. This I, car I see... has all, all the goodies on it. It has this, it has the band on it, a logo on it. There's, it it's not, you know, no, nobody took anything off of it. Right. Even the little Bantam hubcaps. Yep. Jeez. What do you think it was? Factory color? Looks like it. No, nah, it's been a few colors. It's really hard to tell. There's been colors, so many different colors on it. It's neat how the door yeah. goes right into the into the wheel well. But then you get inside, you kind of sit in there. Yeah. As big as a normal car. Well, I had a, I had a, a four passenger, but they weren't any bigger than this. Okay. Okay. And with the convertible, you, that's you, so you, neat. You put your little kids in the back end of it. This is this where the spare goes? Yeah, it is. Huh? Spare tire right here. Jeez. Goes right on there. Okay. Wow, that's neat. That's a neat little car. One tail light? Yeah. That is not the proper tail light. Okay. That is not a proper tail light. I like yeah, this more. tiny little window. Look at that. It's almost like a house latch. That is just crazy. That's neat. I had one of these when I was 16 years old. That's something. When I went to the service, my brother tr traded it on a, on a, a riding lawnmower. Okay. Wow. It has all the little doodads on it, huh? What year is this? It's a 1940. Oh, this is a convertible. When they quit making that, then they made the Army Jeep. Okay. They made the first Army Jeep. Oh, that, that's, that is nice interior, huh? I like the wood. That's something. Like the hubcaps, the pinstripes, that's neat. How's that? I said I like the pinstripes. Oh, yeah. This is striped here. That's a lot of work. That's a nice car. That's neat how it's the wheel is covered. We parked it. Was it like a farm truck or? No, he had a coal truck. Okay. He had he he hauled custom coal. He haul a half a load of coal and another half a load of coal. That's he neat. He went to his arm. Uh uh. You're a truck driver. I don't know. Those are smudge spots. Those are what you that's your safety thing. You took that down there and you lit it and then put it out on the highway instead of flag. Oh, oh that is cool. That is you neat. You don't find that on many trucks. No. No, that's neat. I just wonder. I just seen the condition I like. See there right here. Right oh, here. okay. Yeah. Oh, so you have it. All right. The other one died. I got the other one somewhere. I don't know where it's put it. Yeah, yeah, that's got some coal truck. Yeah. in there. Yeah, it is. That, that's what I saw. No rusting out. I like how the pedals come up. These are probably the original handles. Jeez. That's what I was talking to Ed about, how thick the metal was back right. then. This is cool. I like these big headlights, too. Yeah, this is this would probably be the one I'd want to drag out first that I could afford. Yeah, there's where they rusted out. Yeah, yeah. That has never been no patches or no nothing on it. Jeez, that's something. It's just lounging. Oh yeah. Three twelve, do you say? 312. Vehicle anymore since yeah. it's a double. Yeah. 
This is. You can see this. This thing only got 30,000 30, miles on it. Yeah, I don't think that one doesn't have a lot either. It doesn't does have it? a lot of miles, but this one I know about thirty thousand. Yeah. And you talk about the inside. Look the interior of that. Look on there. Those are those are for the uh, uh, the grill. That's okay. Piece for the grill. This is. This is something else. And again, it's just steel back then. Okay. We're going to buy the 41 D series dump truck. Everything else is probably still going to be for sale. This is about 30 miles south of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. It's around New Stanton. If somebody was interested, they could leave a comment. They're all reasonably priced. I appreciate it. Thank you for watching. truck I really want to get first is the 41, which I believe is a D-Series International. Thanks for watching.